Steph where? <laughs> Steph where? If we ever move in together, I need you to know that I don't like folding clothes and I don't like washing dishes. <laughs> that poppy is popping. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> good morning, good morning, my beautiful people. You know, we have to make us some tea. That's what I'm doing now, y'all. So give me a second and I'll do my proper intro. <laughs> good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, I have on the robe again. <laughs> Y'all, I found this robe in the closet and haven't taken it off since. I cleaned it off, so last um, video, it was looking a little crusty. But anyway, good morning, y'all. Happy Wednesday. I decided to vlog today because I am off of work. The only disclosure I have for today, and I hope you don't mind, is that your girl will be looking like a chicken, okay? I am not doing my hair until Friday, so. If you do not want to stay here, I understand. But if you love me and you don't care whether I look like a chicken or not, then hey. <laughs> I do have to go to physical therapy today, y'all. My shoulder is messed up. I don't know if I ever spoke about it, but I feel like I did. I don't know. I talk too much, so I really don't know. But I messed my shoulder up last year, throwing out the trash, y'all. It's been messed up since and I haven't went to physical therapy and now I'm starting to go. This is only my second time going. So yeah, that's that's where we're going today. And then that's at two o'clock, but I had to go to the gym. We had to get that workout in, girl. We got to get that workout in. Oh, and that book over there, that Atomic Habits book, y'all, so far I am loving it. We're gonna get dressed for the gym. We're gonna go do, I'm gonna try to do some sprints, y'all. I'm just all jacked up this morning because I woke up yesterday, my foot was hurting. I think it was hurting from the sprint class I took because I wore the wrong shoes. I, that's what I'm thinking. We're gonna go to the gym. We're gonna try to walk, try to do some sprints. If it hurt, we're gonna just walk. And then, you know, we're gonna do the rest of our workout and we're gonna, we're gonna be fine this year, y'all. We're gonna be fine all the years, okay? Do y'all know that this is my last year in my 20s? Hold on, y'all. Y'all, this is my last year in my 20s, girl. I turned 29 this year. And I do not want to turn 30. <laughs> I keep thinking about that. Like, oh my goodness, I am turning 29 this year. This is my last year in my 20s. We're not going to get into that, y'all, because I'm, I'm going to get sad. I really don't want to turn 30. I really don't. And that's no shade to nobody that's 30. It's not that I look at it as old. It's just that I just associate my 20s as just being so youthful and just live your best life. And it's like when I'm 30, I feel like, okay, I got to get on my shit. I got to get serious. And I don't want to be serious yet. <laughs> Can't you tell? <laughs> so I'm in a closet right now. I'm scared every time I come in the closet because y'all see that little corner over there? That's where my gym leggings is at, right? And I got more behind this door, but that's where they supposed to be. However, girl, I'm not going over there in that corner because the other day I was over there and I was looking for, you know, leggings I want to wear and I start seeing something jumping and moving. I'm like, hold on, wait a minute, is that a bug? I don't do bugs. <laughs> girl, I don't do bugs. So I think it's a bug underneath of one of them leggings over there. And baby, I'm not touching them. They're going to sit there. If the bug is under there, let it live its best life. But I did put some clothes away yesterday, some new leggings, so they behind this door. So give me one second. It could just be me, y'all. I could have been seeing something, but I'm not even gonna look. I called them people, I tried to call the maintenance man. I'm like, you scared of bugs? You wanna kill a bug? He like, oh no, I don't do that. I'm like, <laughs> Hold up, y'all. BRB, please say goodbye to me. Bye to me. <laughs> so we're gonna do all black can't go wrong with the all black leggings I got from Target I don't know where I got this from I think I got this little bodysuit from Target too you know and then let's get some socks y'all my closet is a mess I ain't even gonna lie to y'all so don't try to judge me even though I don't care but mind your business girl cuz it look a mess <laughs> and I still got clothes I need to put away girl I swear wash and take days I don't know, shout out to them people, because I told my boo, he he actually fold his clothes, y'all, right when they come out the dryer. Like, who does that? 
I don't do that. I'm like, look, there's a few things that I don't do. So if we ever move in together, I need you to know that I don't like folding clothes and I don't like washing dishes. <laughs> <laughs> Those two things, baby, you can hang it up. We are dressed. Had to come here and put a little bit of deodorant on. Woo! Y'all, I am out of all my perfume. This is crazy. Like, this is so ghetto. Y'all, like, I have no more perfume. Like, how did I run out of every perfume that I have? This is crazy. It just lets me know that I need a better collection. Because, baby, how did you run out of everything? This one is even on its last line. What in the world? This ghetto. I left my whole little bag at my boo house and it has some of the stuff that I need in there. I haven't been over there in a little second. I ain't seen my love in a minute, but I need my shit. <laughs> I need my shit. So hopefully I get it this weekend, y'all. Hopefully so. My spray mist that I usually put on my face right before the gym. Because I don't like to wash my face before the gym. So, I usually put on um, the Mario Medusco spray. Is that how you say it? I think that's how you say it. You know, to give me like that refreshing look. But, that ain't the case right now. Valentine's Day is in less than a month, y'all. Less than a month. Okay, what y'all doing for Valentine's Day? Do y'all got a boo? Do y'all have a boo? Do y'all care about Valentine's Day? I feel like all women care about Valentine's Day. My point in bringing it up is that I want to be looking snatched on Valentine's Day. So I literally have one month. Well, it's going to take more than a month, but at least to get me started. I'm trying to at least be slims down about five pounds or so by Valentine's Day. I'm losing weight, though, as we speak. So I stepped on the scale this morning. And you're, even though the scale is not healthy, y'all, y'all should not step on the scale. Don't listen to me, but I'm going to do it. <laughs> I don't do it every day. But anyway, I stepped on the scale today, and I'm 173. Girl, I'm trying to get back in the 160s. I haven't, been, I haven't seen 16 something in probably like two years. Two years! For my birthday, I got down to 170, which is good, it's good for me. For my height, you know, I'm 5'8". But I want to be like 165. I feel like that's a good cushion for me. And then when I went to the doctors in December, um, my doctor told me that my BMI was high. I know that was her way of telling me I was technically, according to you know what they go by, I was technically overweight. She was like, your BMI is a little higher than last time. I'm like, girl, don't be trying to tell me. I need to lose weight. I know I need to lose weight. I don't need you to try to tell me in a nice way. <laughs> But for real, y'all, I do need to slim down because I like to eat, y'all. So when you like to eat, you want to have that extra five pound cushion room. So I ain't about to talk about this, y'all. I talk too much. Uh, y'all get what I'm saying, though. So let me put my shoes on. Best sneakers ever, y'all. These are called Adidas Ultra Boost. I think that's the name of them. My daddy got me these. I say that all the time, y'all. My daddy got me. Oh, see. Oh my gosh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to run y'all. Lord, if it ain't one thing, it's another. God, if it ain't one thing, it's another. Jesus, I'm grateful that I can walk, but God, please heal my foot. Lord knows I wanna walk with no problem. Oh, check out the kicks, y'all. Ooh, <laughs> this is the fit, y'all. We looking real slim and fit. <laughs> With the all black on, looking real athletic, you know? Mm. I'm trying to cut back from coffee. I need to cut back from caffeine overall, but one day I will. Not today, though. Tell me why your girl just signed up for overtime. I was supposed to be off today, y'all. I was supposed to be off today, but I'm like, yo, why haven't they been offering any overtime? Like, hold on, y'all. The titties looking long. Hold on, girl. The titties look long that way. 
So I'm like, why haven't they offered any overtime? Like, what's going on? Did they cut it off? So I sent an email, you know, just to see. And they like, yeah, we have overtime. Um, why you ain't tell me then, girl? I'm trying to get this money. <laughs> they say I can work up to 12 hours. I'm not going to work the whole 12. So this is what we going to do. I'm going to get a little bit of vlogging in because, you know, this is a weekly vlog. You know, I got to still vlog throughout the week. Um, so after I wrap it up today, y'all probably won't see me again until Friday because, girl, we going somewhere exciting on Friday. I'm so excited. My whole point in saying this is I'm going to do a little bit of work, right? Then I'm going to go to therapy, physical therapy, right? And then I'm going to work again. And then after that, girl, I probably ain't going to see y'all until Friday, honestly, because <laughs> I want to work at least at least eight hours today that sounds like a lot don't it? i know but we're gonna get it done girl we're gonna get it done we're gonna get it done i'm making breakfast right now y'all already know the breakfast is those little puff things from trader joe's turkey sausages and eggs it's the same thing so anyway see you guys in a bit bye what's up y'all so we back from therapy it went well i guess we did some different kind of movements with the resistant band uh, I'm working now y'all back at home working again, but I wanted to come on here real quick and show y'all how I make my tomato soup And then I also need to go to Kroger after I get off. I think I want to stop working It's almost six o'clock now. I already work five hours. So I might just stop at like eight What is? Uh, yeah, my goal was eight hours. I think I said that earlier today uh, I look kind of crazy, y'all. I don't know what I got on, but I got something on. It's cold, girl. But anyway, I got to run to Kroger when I get off. So I think I'm going to stop working at 8 o'clock. And then I need, to get, I need to go get some eggs. And I need to go get spring mix. There's a few things I need to grab from the grocery store. And I also want to try some poppy. So we're going to try that on the camera tonight. But let me show you how I make my tomato soup. Because your girl is hungry. What I like to do first is put some onions, a little bit of olive oil, and some garlic inside the pan. You can either do minced garlic or regular garlic, you know, where you chop it up. But my garlic is burning, y'all. I'm so busy trying to work and talk to y'all and cook this. So you just let that, you know, cook down. We're going to turn this down a little bit because it's doing too much, girl. Calm down. Pour that in there. I'm not going to do all of it, but I am going to do a good amount because I'm going to eat this for a few days. We're just going to let that cook down, y'all. Let it heat up a little bit before we start seasoning it and before we add the secret ingredients. Before I show y'all my recipe, right, please don't try to tell nobody you made it up. Just be honest and say, oh my gosh, I love this girl, Rashaya, on YouTube. And she told me how to make my tomato soup like this. Okay? All right. I'm going to show y'all. <laughs> don't mind my stove, y'all. I be cooking. So, first we have pepper. Of course. Got to have pepper. Add pepper to everything. Just a little bit. Everything is just a little bit. We got garlic powder. Just a little bit. Onion powder. Okay. Boom. My boo love this, y'all. I made this for him one time, and he loves tomato soup now. A little bit of salt. I don't even like salt for real, so we're just going to do a little bit of salt. Okay. Some thyme. Now, this I like to put a lot of because this just this don't really taste like much. But it's very has that very fresh kind of taste. And then, final seasoning is basil which i use a lot of this too so we're going to turn this down a little bit because we wanted to thicken up right a lot of basil y'all bam those are the seasonings right now hold on because that ain't it that's not it now if you want to stop there you can but baby if you wanted to taste bomb add these next two ingredients we have shaved parmesan Shave Parmesan. This is what you have to use. Okay, you want to drop just a little few of them in there. About a handful. And this is the last thing, y'all. Heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream. Y'all probably like heavy whipping cream. Yes, girl. Heavy whipping cream. Just a little bit. Whoop. Whoop, whoop. That's it. That's it, girl. Just a little bit. Oh, it's going to be so good. I cannot wait. I have made this with grilled cheese. 
and then I made it with a salad, soup and salad, but uh, I really like it with grilled cheese because I like to dunk my grilled cheese in there. So, do y'all want me to make a grilled cheese for y'all too? Because I can show y'all how I do that. But it's not hard to make a damn grilled cheese, girl. All you're doing is put cheese on the bread and put it on the pan with some butter. I keep on falling <laughs> Anyway, y'all, I'm about to make my um grilled cheese and i'm gonna eat that with my tomato soup and i'm gonna work for like two and a half more hours and then we're gonna run a kroger to go grab a few things to re-up on and then that's probably gonna be it for the night y'all we still got a couple more days on the vlog i know i ain't really do much today but i'm trying to like you know check in when i got a little something going on put a camera out vlog a little bit for y'all so it can all come together you know so see you later Finally together, I am so tired. I pulled 10 hours in at work today. I can't believe I did 10 hours. I can't believe it. I, I told myself I was gonna do eight. And then I'm like, you know what? We not tired yet. Let's throw another two on there, you know? And I got a chance to go to physical therapy, which was good. And then I got a chance to vlog a little bit. So your girl is tired. Your girl is tired. But I did wanna say, I did grab some salad mix. This all stuff for tomorrow. Um, I do have the poppies, y'all. We're going to try those on the vlog. Probably on Friday, which is going to be the next time I vlog. Tomorrow, I'm not vlogging because I'm not doing anything but working. But let me know if y'all have tried poppies before. I heard that this one is really good, which is the raspberry rose. I heard the ginger lime was good. And I keep hearing a lot of people say the orange one is good. So I'm excited to try those, you know. And I got me some watermelon, of course. Gots to have a watermelon on deck. Even though it's not watermelon season. And then this is what I'm about to eat and sit on the couch and mind my business. Okay. Anyway, y'all, I'm talking too much. I'm tired. Good night. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to another day on the vlog. Y'all, I am running behind. I'm running behind. So, I'm not gonna tell y'all where I'm going just yet, probably when I get there, but today is Friday, uh, January 19th, and I gotta put these nails on, and I gotta put some lashes on, and I gotta do my hair all in an hour and a half while I'm still working, y'all. I get off at five o'clock. The event don't start until 6.30. I'm not gonna talk too much. I'm gonna go ahead and record it, and then chop it up, and I'll let y'all see the end result. Okay? Okay. <laughs> and Max and Rick Wizardry. <laughs> Wangsta is my example song. So, so far I have just cut my nails down, filed them down. I like them to be really short before I glue the nails on. And then I'm just buffing them. Well, you're not supposed to use this to buff them, but that buffer that I got, something wrong with it. I don't think it's right. So now we're going to push our cuticles back. Y'all, I really need a, a manicure to be honest. I would recommend putting press on nails on when you have like a good manicure or to get a manicure manicure first unless you know how to do your own but I don't know how to do my own so for now we're just gonna do this okay now I already got it all um set out the way it's supposed to go on my finger I saved it in my phone and then we're just gonna make sure so y'all they look so cute look at them they're so cute what are you talking about oh wow that glue go on there fast I gotta be careful with that this glue dry fast oh my goodness you gotta be careful with this i'm gonna put it under the light just to set it just to make sure that it dry but jesus i don't know how to take the air bubbles out y'all be pressing them too hard but they'll be all right this is the final look they are so stinking cute i gotta hurry up and get ready y'all because your girl is running behind, as always. And don't pay attention to the boxes, y'all. I have yet to take them out. I just put some lotion on my hands first. Ah! We are put together. I am running late, like really. But this is the outfit. I don't know if y'all can really see it. I left my tripod in the car. So, anyway, I got this sweatshirt from H&M. I put like a little, 
I try to put like a turtleneck underneath of it to kind of come up a little bit. But yes, and then I have some leggings on in my black bag and some um, boots with some socks. So anyway, y'all, hold on real quick. Let me get, let me double, double, triple check, make sure I got everything I need. Y'all, my hair is growing out so much. I just made it look like this. I've worn it like this before, but it's growing and I need a haircut. So I thought, I thought it was still cute though. What y'all think? Stiff wear. <laughs> Stiff wear. <laughs> hold on y'all, cause I'm hot. Nails is so cute. I put my lashes on. You know, hopefully we can get something to eat afterwards. Um, it's at 6.30, probably be over by like 7.30. So I feel like by that time I'd be hungry. Anyway, y'all, I'll see y'all when I get there. And I will let y'all know when I'm getting out the car where I'm going. Why am I making this like so extra? But I've never done nothing like this before, but I've been wanting to do it for so long. And I'm gonna take my camera with me just in case. Peace. So I can finally reveal where I'm at. Ah! So I'm at a candlelight concert. I don't know if y'all ever seen these before online, but I see them all the time on TikTok, y'all. And this night they are doing a Rihanna tribute. So they are <laughs> they playing all the Rihanna songs, y'all. I love Rihanna. If y'all don't know already, I love Rihanna. But anyway, I'm running late. I got like 10 minutes. So I'm running here real quick. You know, I think it's an hour long, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm gonna try to record on my phone. I'm not gonna bring my whole camera in there, but Y'all, I am so cold. I should have worn my jacket in there. When I tell y'all that was so nice, I have to go to another one. I have to go to another one. That was so beautiful. Like, OMG, y'all. I'm out of breath. <laughs> I was running to the car. And they do the candlelight concerts in different states. But I know they was just in Dallas. And now they here in Houston. They got another show tonight at 930 but I felt like that was a little too late for me. But anyway, y'all, I love this so much. I'm surprised I didn't cry. I cry about everything. And that was just so beautiful. They are so talented. So anyway, I'm not sure what I'm about to do right now. Think about going to go get some food and maybe a drink. I'm not sure. Or if I just want to go to the house because girl, it's cold outside, honey. It's freezing. <laughs> 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 what's up y'all we back with another day on the vlog y'all it's been two days later your girl ain't really been doing nothing i ain't gonna lie to y'all i ain't been doing nothing nothing at all but i did want to come on here real quick before i start cleaning because today is sunday babes so you know it's time to clean i wrap my hair up so we can get the work in case i start sweating or whatnot but I wanted to tell y'all that I tried the poppy. I know I was supposed to try it on here with y'all. And that is so terrible of me to just pop this open and then don't even show y'all my first reaction. Ghetto, right? <laughs> anyway, this is the ginger lime one, y'all. This is really good. It's good. I can, I can rock with this. I can rock with the poppy ginger lime. I'm not sure how the orange one or the uh, raspberry rose one, I think is the other two I have taste just yet. But this one... 
not mad at it you know i wish it gave you some type of energy but anyway mm. your girl have to clean baby i got to clean the kitchen i got to clean the bathroom and i got so many clothes to fold i'm looking at them right now on the floor i dumped them all on the floor on the couch i'm gonna watch tv and fold the clothes and then once we do that we're gonna get the dishes together get the kitchen together i'm glad that i don't live in like a big apartment to where it's like a lot to clean because it's not like my room is already together the only thing i need to clean is the bathroom the kitchen and put my clothes away that's it girl that's it one two one two so let's get to it and i think i need to go to target so we're gonna clean first though this is ridiculous i hate folding clothes like who likes folding clothes i don't understand like what what's wrong with y'all the people that like folding clothes what's wrong with y'all because me baby i will leave some clothes in the basket after they clean until i feel like folding them <laughs> this and washing dishes is just not my vibe but i'm gonna do it though i'm gonna do it even while i complain i'm gonna do it <laughs> anyway my husband he gonna be like girl you don't fold clothes i'm gonna be like hell no nah. and then he gonna be like well i need you to fold some clothes and i'm gonna be like okay <laughs> is jack says yo i got drug money i could buy you what you want he's like 12. <laughs> <laughs> well sierra is making a lot of waves right now with the naked dress have you guys seen it yes yes have yes. you guys seen it yes okay so Baby, let me tell you something. After all that cleaning, girl, I was tired, okay? I say I need a nap before I go do my other duties for today. So we want to go to Target now. I'm also going to go to TJ Maxx to see if I can find some home stuff. Y'all, it is so cold outside. So I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need to do. Before I go, y'all, I had to put some of this Laneige on, girl. My lips is dry. I keep seeing everybody use the Summer Fridays. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, Summer Fridays lip balm. And I'm like, is that better than the Laneige? Cause I love this stuff, but it costs more, but you get more in the tube. So I don't know. Maybe I'll try it, but for now, maybe I should put some earrings on, bigger earrings. Do you think it matter? No, it don't matter, girl. We ain't, it's, it's Sunday. Ain't nobody out. You know, I ain't trying to impress nobody. I just don't want to look like a boy. I remember one time, y'all, before I leave, let me tell you this quick little story time, right? Girl, tell me why. <laughs> one day I had went to, I think it was Chick-fil-A. Was it Chick-fil-A? I think it was Chick-fil-A. I went into the drive-thru and i didn't have no earrings on i had a hat on but i didn't have one on like this i just had like the scully on without the ball on the top girl i call myself going to go grab some food real quick do you know that lady at the window called me a sir i said well day, do i look like a boy with this hat on with no earrings <laughs> she, i was like sir she's like oh my gosh i'm so sorry yeah girl i don't have one of those i have one of those <laughs> it seemed like ever since i went to that candlelight concert I have been listening to Rihanna. Like, I feel like it's appropriate. I love Rihanna, but I don't really listen to her a lot. I listen to Lil Baby and all that extra stuff. But, girl, I'm listening to Rihanna lately since I left that day on concert. And it's just the vibes. About that concert, because I don't feel like I really got a chance to talk too much in depth with y'all about it. I saw on their website that they do a whole bunch of different cities that they go to. But, you know, you gotta go online, obviously, to check and see if it's in your city or when it would come. But it tells you who the tribute will be for. And then sometimes they do it where they do multiple people, like not just one artist. It's definitely giving date night vibes. It was real cute and classy. Point of the matter is, y'all, if y'all wanna do like a little date night boo vibes, you know, surprise your boo. And ladies, let me tell y'all something too, before I say this. Y'all can plan dates too. Women need to learn how to plan dates, okay? Cause one thing about me, one thing about me, I'ma plan a date, y'all. 
Like, y'all don't always have to just wait for y'all man to plan a date. So, anyway, that's something cute that, you know, girl, you can do and look online for you and your man or something to do. I think it's nice. Or you can go by yourself like I did because y'all know <laughs> y'all know me. Anyway, I want to go, I'm going to go by myself or with somebody. It don't matter. If people ain't available, I'm still going. Had that same attitude in 2024, y'all. Okay, learn how to do solo solo dates by yourself. Anyway, I'm talking too much, as always. They been out like this, like, oh, you dummy. Oh, I'm so sorry. That is not nice. But y'all, I cannot stand when somebody don't go on a yellow light. Why did you not go on a yellow light? And I'm the car right behind you. We are at Target. Here go. Anyway, y'all, I be wondering sometimes, like, do y'all think I'm annoying? Am I annoying? Do y'all be doing too much in my videos? Even though I don't care because that's just who I am. But I want to know, do y'all be thinking I'm annoying? And you better not say yeah. <laughs> you better not say yeah. Now, this little nightgown is so cute. I actually have this one. But the pink one is so cute. But they don't have my size. She is wearing that, honey. I know that's right. She got better shape than I do. Damn. It is cute, though. I don't see it, though, over here. Y'all, this is so cute. Oh, my gosh. This is the workout section. And that is cute. The summertime need to turn, return. The yellow one kind of bright. But that black one is really cute. I need to leave. So I am leaving from over here by the clothes because this is not where I'm supposed to be. I need to be over by the home stuff, y'all. <laughs> this is why I had that budget book because girl, leave it up to me, I would just be spending money. But baby, that's not what we're doing in 2024. Y'all, I lied when I said I was going to TJ Maxx. Girl, I'm already going to the house. It is cold. <laughs> it feels so funny paying with cash, y'all, but it's cool because I don't remember the last time I swiped my debit card. Because why do I feel like rich people don't budget? I feel like people that just got money, that can just do whatever they want, which I will reach that point one day in my life. I have faith in Jesus Christ, amen. I feel like people that got a lot of money or that's rich already, girl, they don't be thinking about no damn budget. They just swipe that card. <laughs> they just swipe that card. All this budget and stuff. Correct me if I'm wrong, y'all. I could be talking crazy, but I really do not believe that those people be budgeting. Like, I don't. I don't. I think they just swipe away. And that's probably why they be going bankrupt <laughs> sometimes. But, yeah. We will get to that point one day in life, Jesus. But for now, baby, we need a budget. <laughs> I have been needing to pick up my refill for my Adapalene for like a week now. I paid for it already, so. Looks like we have the Adapalene. You paid pre online already? Yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. Let me go grab it for you. Thank you. Got that Adapalene, baby. Thank you, Jesus, for my dermatologist. Oh my gosh, guys, my battery is going dead. I might gotta catch up with y'all later. I had to change and get comfy, girl. I put my, I'm a genie and I bought on, baby. Little hat on. <laughs> my brother be like, what you wanna make a wish? Every time I wear this thing, he be sounding like a genie. <laughs> anyway, y'all, um, I might gotta catch up with y'all later. I don't know what we're gonna do later anyway. I know for sure we're gonna smoke some hookah. But that ain't gonna be till later on. We're gonna drink our kombucha and smoke some hookah. And then we need to find something to eat. So, this little um, thing, thing, what is this? Nightgown, I guess you wanna call it, girl. Got it from Target. Love it. Target might be the spot now for a little nightgown. I need to get some more night clothes, but. Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna put this stuff away. Yes, to be a tabaline. I'm gonna put this stuff away, y'all. It look different. And um, why it look different? Hold on. 
I hope she ain't trying to give me no foo foo. Girl, let me try to give me no generic version. I need the real stuff. <laughs> Girl, is about to run out to get some food. I finally made my mind up on what I want. I'm gonna let y'all guess. One, two, three. We gonna eat pho. Pho. Y'all, I haven't had pho in so long. So I just threw the first thing on that I seen in my closet, which was some sweatpants. And this, I'm not gonna go outside with this thing on my head. Bam. We looking like earlier. <laughs> Oh, let me call it in, y'all, because I don't want to have to wait. Let's call it in. Okay, what do you want for your order? Yes, may I have a shrimp pho? Two minutes. All right, thank you. Two. Have a good one. Bye. Y'all, why I play with that lady like that? First of all, I'm like extra shrimp. Then I thought about it. Like, hold on, how much is extra shrimp? Because I ain't paying no, mm -hmm, I ain't paying no four or five dollars for shrimp. Anyway, and then they only give you like one or two more. So... Let's go. By the time I get there, it'll be ready, y'all. So, see you guys when I get there. And then when I get back, and we can do like a little mukbang. We can do a little mukbang. Okay, I'm excited. <laughs> y'all see me? Can y'all see me? We back at the crib, y'all. So, let's pop us open a, a poppy. This is the orange. I'm excited. Y'all, I gotta be careful with these press ones. Here we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all be having too much fun. <sighs> Y'all, I'm running out of space on my dad on camera. Hold on. Okay, the orange one might be better than the lime one, the ginger lime. Oh, that's blessing. Y'all, I'm so excited to eat my food. We're gonna do a little mukbang. And then we can also talk a little bit, maybe about, um, I was thinking earlier, I was thinking earlier, maybe we can talk about self-love. <laughs> Let's talk about some self-love. Oh, before we talk about that, I haven't even told y'all the news for this year for me. Did I tell y'all that I'm moving this year? No, I don't think I did. So we're gonna talk about self-love another time. Because we know self-love, it can be so, so deep and so passionate. And right now, I don't know if I want passion for the way I'm about to eat this food. <laughs> so anyway, like I said, I am moving this year, y'all. I have made a decision that I don't want to live here anymore. My lease is going to be up in a couple of months. So probably more than a couple. I got a little, I got a little while to be here. But there's nothing wrong with the community. I love the community. But um, I want to be a little closer to the city. That's why I'm moving, y'all. If it wasn't for that, girl, I would not be moving. Because I really do love my apartment so much. If you live here in Texas, y'all know that it is a lot of driving. A lot. So, there's some hot sauce. The less driving, the better for me. I'm going to pour it with y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That orange is popping. That poppy is popping. <laughs> I ain't really got nothing to say, y'all. I thought we was gonna have a mukbang and you know talk and all of that, but I ain't got nothing to say, y'all. Mmm. Mmm. All I can say is thank you, Jesus. Mmm. I thought I wanted to smoke the hookah, but baby, I lied. I lied, I lied, I lied, and I'm sorry. Because girl, after I ate that food and drank that little poppy, I'm feeling real cozy. It's giving me snuggle up on the couch and go to bed. <laughs> Actually, y'all know what I wanna do? I wanna get into one of these TV shows. I have not seen, um, what is this TV show people have been talking about? Top, is it Top Boy? Snowfall! Girl, I have yet to see Snowfall. I have not seen not one episode. So I think I might watch Snowfall and kind of vibe out for the night and just lay on the couch and mind my business, you know? I feel like we had a good old time in the vlog, you know? I feel like we did a little song song. 
we did a little sign sign you know i see y'all next week anyway so <laughs> I feel like it's appropriate. I had to see when I edit. But anyway, I hope y'all had a good time. I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. I hope y'all love me like I love y'all. And I hope y'all be feeling the energy the way that I be giving it on the camera, girl. <laughs> anyway, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you do not like the video, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all for what? Clicking on a video. And I will see you guys in my next vlog.